Hi, hi everyone. This video I have a surprise for you. Uh, this is a rare fish island. That's how I, how I called it. So, what's so special about this island? So, just take a look. It just looks like a regular island. That's what I thought when I arrived there. And I'm just trying to farm and fish and enjoy, you know, uh, uh, this new island. And uh, But, this island holds a very deep secret. I didn't pay attention for this the first time and some of you might visit this island and didn't pay attention for it, uh, to it as well. But if you look carefully, you can see there are no small fish, only big fish. And also rare fish are super common here, you can find plenty of them. And by that I mean like tuna fish, uh, the collar canth fish which you can sell for 50 grain, the oar fish uh, and others very common here of course it depends on the uh, on the month but you can farm for rare fish and earn tons of money now i actually when i just hang around and start fishing i didn't even realize that but i just i'm just looking and i see hey, there are no small fish there none so then it realized oh there's something special about this island and i could you know if i just came here and just do my thing and go back whew, what a miss now when I say big fish, I mean in terms of the shadow in the water, you know, sometimes you have a relatively big shadow and get a kind of small fish. I'm just talking about the size of the shadow. I, I don't know uh, the numbers, I think it's three and four. Here I actually, uh, uh, this is the first time where I actually caught, uh, I thought here that I was actually lucky. Still here I didn't realize that it's a, a rare fish island and I was just fishing regularly. Uh, but something, you know, felt weird. I think in the, in the second one I, over I realized that something is... Uh, you know, suspicious here, you know, I can't get two uh, rare fish in one island, I mean, it's such a very short interval. Now, this is the moment where I actually realized, I remember now, this is the, because I now I, it, I connect with, this is the moment I actually realized that something is completely wrong here, can't be like three big fish, you know, near each other. there's no small fish, and then I say, I start getting excited, and I told myself, oh my god, this is this is this is something special and then I stopped doing all this standard stuff you see I'm just getting too excited about and then I knew that uh, I'm gonna uh, you know I'm gonna do something different I'm gonna farm for those rare fish and see if it, it is uh, uh, you know a very uh, a special island and then I see this one and then I see a big one again and m my mind goes crazy just racing like crazy right now I knew now I knew uh, this is a special island I don't know, 95%. After the third one, uh, the, th the fourth one, I, I knew it's. I'm just gonna find so many fish here, rare fish. Now, speaking about farming for this Strigon, here I have so plenty, and you're gonna see soon. Here I'm catching other type of uh, uh, large fish. But of course I'm gonna get rid of all of this. Look how many other, uh, you know, relatively normal fish I have. Uh, but of course I'm gonna throw them all away because my goal at this point was to have a full, going back home, full of fur fish. And the thing is that I really like fishing in this game. This is my favorite thing in this game. Uh, so for me it's like heaven, heaven to be in this island. Better than the Tarantula Island, which I also visited. This is the most expensive fish, I think, uh, uh, and I plenty of them as well. Uh, it's rare to get, uh, but a really cool surprise at the end. You're gonna see. Here, I'm actually uh, making sure that I have, uh, you know, actually my uh, rod broke, of course, because you did so much, and I needed to create more uh, fishing rods, and that's what I did. Here, I'm catching another one. Now the thing here is uh, that I recommend just preparing. Uh, no, you don't need to come with uh, a second road uh, to this island. What I did was actually just, you know, just check a tree and get those materials, which you can build a, a simple one, and then uh, you can just uh, s uh, smash some rocks. I didn't even smash all of them uh, to get um, the material needed to build the stronger road. And then you and I have plenty of them. And just in case that you don't have, you can always. Uh, uh, build the flimsy ro uh, road and, and use it. Uh, so the thing is when you get there uh, you're gonna manage. Uh, so no problem. Here I'm actually, that's what I'm doing. I'm just uh, trying to farm for this material. I forgot the name uh, because I want to build a stronger road so I don't need to replace it every single time. And from that point on of course it's all about uh, here I already know this is I'm gonna come back full of rare fish uh, 
and just one after the other I just hooked them up and it was so funny and I just remember trying to farm for them just before you know yesterday two days ago uh, farm I didn't spend too much time but I did spend time uh, and here yeah, just coming like you know like nothing you just fish them right uh, one after the other Now for those of you who like fishing, this is heaven, heaven, I'm telling you. This is so satisfying. And especially when you feel the shake of the of the controllers every time shaking like crazy. This of course the most expensive one. Uh Euro is actually uh, going to this pier because in this pier you can actually get you'll see the tuna fish. You can actually get there. Uh the tuna fish. So I got the tuna fish. I actually got a few of them. Uh this is not the most expensive one, but you know, uh it's fun getting different type of uh, rare fish that you, before that, you actually work so hard to get. So yeah, why not a second tuna fish, right? <laughs> right after the other, yeah? No problem. I'm fine with this, no problem. So you can see managing things, but it's very easy. You just throw away the fish, the cheap ones. You don't really care about them. Maybe before you care, but here on the rare fish island, you really don't care. You just throw them and replace them with the more expensive ones. One after the other, <laughs> they're just coming like nothing. And of course, in between, I caught some, uh, uh, because it was hard for me to differentiate sometimes uh, between the large and the extra large, the big ones, the rare one, rarest ones. Uh, so I caught quite a few of those uh, 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 cheap fish on the way, but I just get rid. I didn't care, actually, you know, just enjoy fishing anyway. Um, so that's what I did. So if you see two of them near the other, it's very easy to tell. But for me, it was quite a bit. But when you see this one is really big, you can see it big. But sometimes I made a mistake. I didn't know, especially in different angles. It wasn't clear for me. Uh, but soon you're going to see something that you see a comparison between the two. Here, another tuna fish that I caught. Here I'm just uh, making again another road because i <laughs> just <laughs> another fishing road because i'm just uh, you know finishing them like crazy and fishing so many here another very rare fish this one worth 15k this one is very easy to recognize. Here I actually knew when it's big or not. I don't know why, because it's, you don't see many of them uh, uh, hit there. And if you see a small one, you can see a small one. If you see a big one, you know it's a big one. So there it's actually was very simple. I literally got hooked <laughs> in, the, in this island. And uh, luckily I pay attention to this because I could easily ignore it. But it's very, when you just play the game, uh, for a lot of hours, you, you see that something is wrong. You see that it's just too many big shadows in the water. It's not something common that you see, you know, uh, generally when you play the game. So it's kind of a, you know, you pay attention to it and you see that something is uh, different. I'm sure there are many other islands probably that have their secret and we need to figure out what it is. That makes you think when you get to an island, uh, stop, see, try to see if there's something uh, secretive about this island. Maybe there's a... You know something you need to find maybe just not a normal island uh, so just pay attention to the how it looks uh, while i play so you can recognize it uh, after that i'm going to show you in more detail but you can see here look at this you have actually three of them three of them, all those three that you see on the screen right now all of those are rare fish each one and one of them right next to each other i just take the first one i didn't want to scare the second one so i captured the first one then the second one then the third one, right next to each other. Insane, right? So when I say very common, you can see it right here. So you can see me just throwing the cheap ones. Who cares? You know, 2,000, 4,000, <laughs> doesn't matter when you have like fish that cost, you know, and you can sell for 9,000, 10K, 15K. Of course, it doesn't matter right now. And I can only, oh, by the way, this actually happened after I upgraded, uh, um, I bought the thing that allows to uh, improve the amount of space that you have in your inventory. I actually did it today, luckily, because it could, uh, you know, if I haven't done it, I would have less space and I could have earned much less. How much I am going to see later on in the end, 
uh, so I was quite lucky getting it, you know, at the right time, so I can have lots of space. I actually thought about the Tarantula Island, but I didn't expect to get to this type of island. Now all those red snappers, you can say for 4,000, so they are pretty good, worth quite a lot, but I got rid of all of them. Oh, it's just, look at this, throwing a red snapper. I wouldn't have done it in the world, but now, tch, who cares? We just throw them because they are, you know, relatively compared to the others, they are very cheap. So this is the, the third one, as you can see. Again, three rare fish right next to each other, just throw the fishing rod and uh, capture them. Of course, the party continues. I'm moving to the right side, to the left side, uh, to the bottom, and just circle it. You can also check the cliff top, by the way. There aren't many fish there, but if you have baits, you already came with baits. Uh, you can actually capture one of those uh, rare fish that actually spawned there. I tried a few times, didn't get it. I, oh, I took a look, you know, from time to time, but uh, the spawn is actually quite bad. So uh, uh, I, I have actually bait uh, um, fish bait when I came here. So I actually used them, but they didn't even find uh, uh, the rare one over there. But over all the other areas, it was very easy. And one tip for you, uh, you know, instead of just, uh, uh, if you just want to, the big fish, the rare ones, of course, that's what you want. You can actually scare just the small ones, small ones, the relatively small ones, just scare them away. You can do this by either just running uh, just running so very close to the shore uh, near the water and then it will scare them away and you can also if they if they're a bit too far away you can just throw the hook uh, and then when they just close or the bite doing the first bite just put it up uh, pull it up and they will just disappear and I did it many times and this is a way to uh, kind of refresh re uh, everything so they just go and other come instead this way you can actually do this really really fast now he actually just went to show you the island and then I saw another fish on the way, I, 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 it was over for me. So I actually caught this one and this is the more expensive ones, the most expensive one among those that I actually caught. And now I need to get rid of something. But look at this, they are all very fish. So I just threw, what? The Storgian. Why? Because I have so many of those. I didn't, the tuna worth less, but actually it was harder for me to find the tuna. So I decided to stay with the tuna and just for this drag, uh, Stragion. And look at this. This is just, if you are farming for Stragion, don't look at this. This is, this really hurts. Oh my God, so sad, so sad. So you can clearly see now uh, the inventory uh, full. And at this point, you know, after spending hours, hours, not because I, because I enjoyed it, I enjoyed it so much. I've decided, uh, okay, before I go to take some pictures because, you know, you don't get to get to this island every single day. Luckily, they will get there again, hopefully, because it's so much fun and I like fishing in Animal Crossing New Horizons so much. Uh, so I took a few photos. Uh, excited, I was very excited here. But it's time to wrap things up. I was already full and it feels really bad to just capture, you know, uh, rare fish and just throwing them to the water. Doesn't feel good, I'm telling you. So, um... I decided to wrap things up and uh, after taking a picture I went to the plane and go back uh, to my island. But, 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 there's a surprise here. <laughs> On the way back, of course, you know, I just went to the plane and uh, guess what I saw? Yeah, another one. Just waiting for me. Come on, take me, take me home. Take me home. So I can't just look at this and not try to fish it, right? If I take it, don't take it, I need to at least, uh, you know, capture it. Now we already know what I'm going to do with this, right? And if not, I'm going to throw it back to the water. It's so sad. Oh, it's so sad. 
What can I do? I'm full. I wish I had more space. I wish. Anyway, it's time to go home. We are very happy, me and the pilot. And uh, now I want to see how much is all worth. So I select everything. Uh, look how many of them. Look how many of them. This is insane. This island is crazy. And uh, the total for everything uh, at the end was about 430k. Which is very, very good. And if you compare it to the Tarentals, I... Uh, Anyway, it's good anytime because I need to pay the loan. So this is it. I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, I hope I get to see more cool surprises and Animal Crossing New Horizons. Uh, and that's it. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you on the next video. Cheers. Bye-bye.